And we're rolling. Um, I'm here on the corner of Lincoln Road in Washington. It's the 420 building. Something really exciting is happening on the fourth floor. It's all about art. And um, this is my friend, Xavier Cortada. Known him for a long time. Um, he's a great artist and he's very involved in um, environmental art and he gives back to the community. Can you tell us a little bit about what you're doing, Xavier, and what the purpose of this new space is? Sure, we're at the Miami Beach Urban Studios, Florida International University's FIU's presence right here on South Beach. The College of Architecture and the Arts, all seven of its departments, music, theater, art and art history, communication arts, landscape architecture, interior design, and architecture, have a presence here. It's a laboratory, an urban space where our faculty and students get to interact with all the wonderful cultural institutions nearby. Everything from the New World Symphony to the Wilsonian to the Bass. In order to engage community in dialogue, in order to work with community to use art, to problem solve, and for our students to learn and grow with the community. And I'm here running the Office of Engaged Teaching, Scholarship, and Creative Activities that work with faculty to do just that. So it's an exciting time. It's an exciting time for South Beach, a really urban and relevant place. And I, I'm so happy to see Lincoln Rowan have the gravitas of this academic institution and this college teaching and learning in this community. Um, when did this start, Xavier? Today. Today is the opening. Today, September 20th, we open. We just uh, had our classes start last week here. So we're literally launching this initiative. We have a gallery space where we'll have rotating shows that our art faculty curate. Mm -hmm. We have uh, opportunities for films to be screened, for poets to recite, for people to think uh, and collaborate. But more importantly, we also have space outside these walls. And that's what it is about. It's about an urban laboratory where these different thinkers come together in a multidisciplinary way and look at the city as a, as a big canvas to think, create, and work. So that's what's really exciting. That's really the, the beauty of having FIU, you know, are one of the largest public universities in the U.S., top 25, working here in this urban setting to uh, use art as a way of engaging community. This is wonderful. And then you also have classroom space here of as well, course. right? we have three classrooms. We have 62 graduate students uh, working in their design studios. We have MFAs who have their studios here. We have exhibit space. Just in that direction, we have a couple of studios where uh, musicians can uh, rehearse. Uh, and then, of course, we have administrative offices and a conference room with my Antarctic garden. And hey, it's a wonderful, yes, wonderful yes, place. actually, it's a cool I, thing for. I love the I love the Antarctic art. It's yeah. amazing. Um, but but if we get into that, it's going to be a whole other video. It's going to be an entire video <laughs> about global climate change and sea levels rising right here in our um, shores, Xavier, which is why it's in this room. Yeah, you're one of the coolest artists I know, um, and I will link to your uh, art on on my blog post so that people can learn about it. But thank you so much sure. for your time, and I'm very excited. South Beach should be proud with, uh, you know, with the New World Symphony campus and happening recently and this happening. Um, I'm seeing like a, you know, a blossoming of a new kind of intellectual and artistic community here that is, that really we should have here. So congratulations. Thank you.